Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Octopath Traveler with me, Jalanon, and Lunar Nebula Gaming. So, I can't remember if my summon's still here. Uh, Primrose... Primrose did not get the XP from beating Master... Well, curse his name? Helganish. So, that is something to keep in mind. When people are down, they do not get XP, so that's important. Let's go find this Alvin. Or city? I guess it's a city. So we'll go that away. Looking for treasure as we go. Hmm, caught by surprise. Ah, oh, thunder does work on you. Okay. Hmm. I guess we'll see. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Hmm. Right, I don't have my summon anymore. We did part ways. Alas, for some, I knew thee well. Um, let's do... Three attacks. Get rid of this. There we go. How about you? And then we can do more cool stuff. Like level slash. I will cut you down! Alright. What to do? You, my merchant. Yeah, I think we'll just do this, even though, really, she probably does more damage with her bow. Even with the vulnerability. Yeah. An interesting dilemma. Yeah. Ah! We'll do an ice oh, wing. Ice. Here's some fruit. There we go. No I am ready. Mm, we could do Moonlight Waltz or something. Yeah. The there we go. All right, Victory we'll get you shall be mine. another level. The is out of my way. There we go. Uh, the thrill of the fight. The unbending blade. There we go. Oh, I didn't check if job points were uh, not given when Primrose went down. Okay, no, nothing else over here. Just this treasure and spiriting plum. Uh, looks like I can't go around there, so we will continue onwards to the Riverlands. Okay, we got 357 money. Hmm. Interesting. Seems like they have more money. West Clearbrook, traverse to Clearbrook. Sunshade and Saints Branch. All right, we could save, but. Wait, what's this? 500 money. We'll take it. We will take it. Alright then. We will check real fast over here. Yeah. I think this is the way I want to go anyway. Yeah, it looks like north would have been some other thing. Hmm. I can't get in there. Time to teach you a lesson. Huh. Snails and things. I am ready. Hmm. Well, we can do our moonlight waltz here. All right. Then. Hmm. Victory shall be mine. Pain. Could do thousand spears. I will cut you down. We'll do that. Now, what next? Then I bet. Fire is good against these wasps, but I don't know. I have 95 SP. I'll try fire. Oh, flames! Rage! Rock! Okay. Snail is vulnerable to it, Here so it took go. more damage. Hmm. I'll try to KO the slug. There we go. Oh, right there. Hmm. More slashes? I will cut you down! There we go. An interesting dilemma. I think we try lightning. Uh, there it is. I am ready. Uh, right. Maybe the knife is going to be. What eh. to do? Uh, let's try the bow. You got Couldn't more tell. than you bargained for. Oh. Hey, more levels though. Good. 
Looks like our XP gain is plodding along at a decent rate, which is nice. Hmm. This is by the same team that made Bravely Default, Triangle Strategy, etc., etc. Hopefully many more to come. Okay, lots of treasure chests here. Wow. I like it. Healing Grape. Hmm. About over here. All right. Well, Primrose, hopefully we are heading to a happier ending for you. Very dramatic episode last time. Hmm. Let's see. Where to save over? I guess we'll take this one. All right. Hmm. I'll go this way for now. Yes. Yes. May I There's some sort of town this way. Okay, so your My weak turn now. eyes. Hmm. Ah! Okay, weak to bones. Uh, you're probably weak to slashes. I will cut you down. Yep. Okay. I am ready. Hmm. I want to try moonlight waltz. Oh, one of these ah! rivers brought us. Oh, that worked. Okay. Ah. Hmm. Ah. Ice ice. Through. There you go. Alright. Now we can just focus I'm in. Ready. Good Moonlight Wall. She'll probably get another level soon enough that that's worth it. My turn now! Hmm. The battle is truly joined. Ribbon Frog in three. Ah. Meet my blade. Which With is unbeatable. Battle, I grow strong. Okay. Yeah, Primrose is already almost leveling. Very good, very good. Okay. Hmm. What else do we search for? Why, hi. Welcome to Clearbrook, where the waters are pure and still. Okay, is this where I need to be? Maybe. Yes. No. Oh, I still need to go further east, it looks like. Yeah, okay. Hmm. Let's try scrutinize. The strongest woman in the village, a fact in which she takes tremendous pride. Word of her physical prowess has spread far and wide, inviting invitations of marriage from equally formidable men. However, the only invitations she cares to entertain are from challengers seeking to test their might against hers. Okay. We uh, get a discount. Cool. Hmm, purchase what we get. A steel axe, not for sale. Huh. Can we decrease the target's elemental attack, though? Okay, what would we get? Head bash, axe attack, strength of two, 80% chance to allure. What's the challenge? Level two? Okay, so it looks like challenge strength and allure strength are pretty similar. Hmm. I wonder if... <laughs> If she'd want to marry Ulbrich, if that challenge went through. I kind of want to try this. Alright. Oh, how fascinating. Is that a dance from the east? Pray, Camille. Alright. We have a new friend. Oh, dear. <sighs> My grandfather's cough is getting worse, but he still won't give up that pipe of his. Might be a little too late, to be honest. Uh, 36% chance, wow, that's pretty low. But I don't think there's any way to increase the chance at the moment. Maybe there's one passive skill later or something that will help. But for now it seems like you just try and you pay money if you fail. Oh, that worked. The doting granddaughter of an ailing old man who traveled the world in his youth. Ever since she was a child, she has admired her grandfather, whose exploits she endeavors to record as she cares for him in the final years of his life. Okay, hidden item. But where? Well, looks like it's to the east on the map. A silver hairpiece or a protective earring. These look a little bit cheaper too, but we're so close to 16,000, and 16,000 seems like a big break point for the really good items. So I'll wait, I'll wait. Plus you never know if we're gonna need that money for our next recruit. Hmm. Here's our tavern. Well mate Traveler, what can I do you for? Hear a tale? Huh. Okay. 
Restore reputation. I think we're good. All right. Good enough. So, interesting. When we unlock our next character, probably to the east here, that might unlock that. Oh. Oh, you are right here, I guess. Hmm. We could sell stuff. So yeah, the old coin has not changed price. So I think this might just be everything we can get until maybe Tressa gets some more stuff. I will go ahead and sell one old coin. And we will hope we get good stuff out of it. What about you? We've also learned if you do lose reputation in town and you start somebody's story, it does seem to reset your reputation level when you start their story. So, best to scrutinize now. A young apothecary of Clearbrook. Zeph lost his parents to the Great Pestilence at a young age, and thereafter had to care for his sister, Nina, by himself. As she is his sole surviving family, he feels this responsibility keenly, and is resolved to place her welfare above his own. All right, hidden item. Another thing we can do is get these hidden items on the map, and then this character should be able to find them on the map, if we can. You know. Let's get Sitting Dust, because it might be useful in the future. Yeah. Purifying Seed. Hmm. Okay. Wait. Word! I want those. So many people are leaving the village, huh? Okay, do I want the Purifying Seed? We go below what I'd like. I think I'll do it anyway. So many people end up leaving the village. And then we say, always looking for a bargain. As if that's why people are leaving the village. Yeah, thanks, Tressa. Thanks. Very hey. common sense. Nina's brother is the best apothecary in the entire village. Okay. Screw noise. Friends with Nina since childhood. The two have grown up like sisters. The rather more strong-willed Nina often takes the lead on the secret adventures into the dangerous wilds outside the village. Most intriguing. I hear you, cat. Okay, healing grape, yes. We get these cheap. Healing great bunch. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you so much. All right. Our bargains have been found. We can't pet the cat. Oh, well. Hello, cat. This we will try to pick up with our friend in the future. Here's a save point. Uh, ooh, what are you? <sighs> okay. Uh, apparently I have to be somebody else. Fine. We'll worry about that later. Ah. Did you know that rivers in these parts flow beneath the surface as well as above? Well, they do. All sorts of interesting things float here from other towns in the Riverlands. Okay. Screw noise. How can I allure her by now? Hmm. 12%. I think it's time somebody taught you a lesson. <laughs> Forgive me. Fail four more times, and then we lose stuff. Can I have multiple mighty blows? Strength? Is her strength that high? 5% chance. Yeah, no, no. But she is apparently insanely strong. Hmm. Get another one of those. Hmm, he must be someone's servant. Such a good little person, I guess. Okay. All right. Try again. All right. Let's go down here. Talk to you before we try that again. Beautiful flowers called water blooms grow in the cave of Rayo just ahead. Alas, there's other not so pretty things lurking there. Like blotted vipers, for example. Nasty critters. You do well to keep a wide berth. Okay. Scrape noise. Oi, what do you think you're doing? Hey, forgive me. Try again. According to my research, the snakes inhabiting the cave of Ryo, be they large or small, can be lopped in two with a few solid swings of an axe. The nasty froggins that roam the rows will not go down so easily. But so long as one has the means to freeze the dang things, one should muddle through somehow. Okay, so. Yes, we do have the means to freeze. What's our challenge do? Strength two? Not right now. It does seem like Ulbrich might be better to pick up a little bit later in the game. Uh, in terms of he can get JP easily from challenges. Another iron vest. No. I'll, I'll wait until we get our next character, I think. Because then they might use that. So, most likely our next character will have an axe. 
based on that little interaction, I would think. Now what? I thought I saw... Hmm. Must have been a lens flare. Okay. Okay, never mind. Yep. Ah. Alright, we try once more. The fiend. Oh, it worked! Good. This old woman was carried to Clearbrook by the whim of fate, much like the waters of the river she watches over. Perhaps she hopes that in time it will cleanse her of a lifetime of sin, of banditry, of murder, of worse. Or perhaps she seeks only to live out her days in quiet. Mm, we will see. Yep. Hopefully it's a good item. A new treasure. Oh, okay. So, hopefully it's an axe for our new friend shortly. Okay, there's that one. All right, we will save because that was very lucky. Now saving, please wait. All right, so we didn't even have to waste all of our scrutinizes and stuff. Sweet. Uh, can I go inside the inn? Not really. Yeah, we don't need it. We don't need it. Let's see, talk to you, friend. Alfin, Zeph, Nina, you better hold on for me. Aren't they right here? There ain't no way I'm letting that venom beat you. You hear me, Viper? I'm coming for you. Ah. So we gotta get an antidote. His name is Alfin, and he is an apothecary. His whole life has been spent in the pastoral village of Clearbrook, where he looks after the residents as a young apothecary. He is not alone in his efforts, though. Zeph, his best friend since boyhood, worked alongside him. But when Zeph's little sister is bitten by a deadly viper, it falls to Alfin to fashion an antidote before the poison takes her. And so he ventures out to the cave of Ryo, where he must do battle with the dread beast. He will need caring allies on the path he has chosen. Okay. Take Alfin along. Oh, so we can only have four people. Um, Primrose is... Fun. We are stuck with Cyrus and Ulbrich. That's interesting. I like having Tressa so that we can purchase stuff, maybe. She's also good at not dying at the moment. But Primrose needs the XP. Tressa doesn't need the XP. I would probably replace Ulbrich otherwise, but... Uh, we'll replace Tressa for now. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that. For now. Interesting. Hey, repetition's back. <laughs> Is this the guy that won't stop smoking? Hmm. Grandpa, be strong! Can you really save him with that medicine of yours? You betcha. Just sit tight. Bam! That should do her. Drink it down slowly now. Well, I'll be. Thank you, my boy. <laughs> Don't mention it. Just doing my job. This will stop the coughing for now, but your lungs have seen better days. Try to give the pipe a rest, sir. Here. Oh, Elfin, thank you ever so much. How blessed we are to have an apothecary like you in our little village. It's not much, but please... Nah, it's on the house. Why don't y'all hold on to that and buy something tasty for you and your grandpa? I'll be back to check in on him, okay? Huh? In this age, the arts of medicine and healing are still in their infancy. With the disease and illness rampant, the people rely on salves and tinctures fashioned by apothecaries. Or Mama. Salves. Did you see me, Ma? I whipped up an anti tuss of elixir like you wouldn't believe. Anti-cough? 
can't believe it's been a year already. Am I any closer to being the man I want to be? The man he was. Alf, I've been looking all over for you. It's kind of funny they have like a green shirt uniform. Huh. Hey, is F done for the day? Yes, only two patients today. Having you around sure eases the burden. If only I could convince you to quit giving out discounts. Oh, come on. Everybody's gotta eat. The poor gal has enough trouble looking after old Alec. I can't very well take what little she has. <laughs> I'm just teasing. You know that's what I like about you. If the villagers are healthy and happy, that's more than good enough for me. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. We may be new to this, but between the two of us, this village is in good hands. Sure is. Plagues, epidemics, bring your worst. Please no. Please no. I'm counting on you, Alf. We all are. Who would have thought that little troublemaker would turn out to be a top-notch apothecary, huh? We can't all be born with a silver pestle in hand, Master Zef. Your mother would be proud. Maybe. Anyway, I should be getting back to Nina. Yeah, beat it. Head on home, big brother. Hey, Alfin. We've been friends ever since we were small, right? I know you better than anyone, so be honest. You're keeping something from me, aren't you? Um... <laughs> I'm right, aren't I? Alf, the truth is... Master Zeph! Master Zeph, you must come quickly! It's... It's your sister. These look like bite marks. Alfin, could you take a look as well? Hmm? You got it, buddy. The second opinion. She's fallen into a deep trance. This is worse than we thought. Hmm. Indeed. Nina's the only family I have. If I lost her, I'd... Hmm. Wish she could tell us what happened. It's safe to assume she was bitten by something poisonous. But what? Without knowing the nature of the poison... Yeah, the wrong medicine could make things worse, and quick. That's one reason if you get bitten by a snake, it's pretty important to figure out which snake bit you, or try to catch the snake, and or chop it up and then take a, you know, you know, just some evidence of what kind of antidote you need, or antivenom. Damn it all! What foul beast did this to my Nina? Let me ask around. Maybe someone saw something. A good point. Hmm. All right. So, what can you do? Alfin can inquire and learn all sorts of information. So, hmm. Seems very similar to scrutinize. Let's go get these hidden items. Sleepweed. Okay. Did you see anything? So, inquire. Hmm. Looks like we've already done it now. Oh, okay, it's... Huh, tell me more, inquired about something for the first time. So that green check mark is not... Not that we've already done, or no? Oh, it is like the same thing. Nice chatting with you. So we can kind of switch between the two, I guess? Hmm. Also, there's a treasure chest there. Why did I not see this? 
All right. Hmm, the kids don't want to talk to me. Okay, so yes, yeah, scrutinize and inquire seem to be the same, so they probably have different success rates. Probably. Nobody in here wants to talk to me. Okay. What about down here? Okay. You? Hopefully I didn't ruin anything by scrutinizing so many people. Okay, she knows Nina's secret. Nice chatting with you. So maybe there have been a couple times we didn't get anything from Scrutinize. Maybe we have to inquire instead. Come on now. Lily? The bite marks on Nina's leg. You sure you don't know where they came from? Um... It's pretty important. Huh. I want to help your friend, but I'm an apothecary, not a miracle worker. If I don't know what bit her, there ain't nothing I can do. Which means there's still something you could do. Double negatives. Oh? You want to help her too, right? So just tell me, please. Nina. Wanted to pick water balloons. Is... For her brother. I wasn't so sure about it, but I went with her to that cave. And then, this giant snake came out of the bushes, and, and... What kind of snake? Was it black? No... I can't believe it, but... Don't tell me. Was it amber with blotches on its back? Yes. And how did you know? That would kill Mom? Holy... The flame take me. A blotted viper. I'm sorry. I know we're not supposed to go there. Good reasons, apparently. But Nina wanted it to be a surprise, so... So she told me to keep it secret, and... I see. Thanks, Lily. You've told me all I needed. You are a brave girl to bring Nina back here. Don't you worry anymore about that scary snake here. We're gonna chop it in half. Probably. Nina. Good gods. A blotted viper? Hmm. A nasty critter if there ever was one. This ain't good. Hmm. Time is of the essence. The poison is spreading through her veins as we speak. I must prepare an antidote with all haste. <sighs> That's why. But I need to get my hands on the original venom. There's supposed to be a nest of vipers in the cave of Ryo, yes? Give me a break. Yeah, along with plenty of other nasties. Reckless ain't the half of it. Well... I know, but what choice do I have? I'll leave at once. Look after Nina for me. Hold on now. Seth? Hmm? <laughs> You look after her. I'll go. Huh. Elfin, are you mad? I'm responsible for Nina. I won't let you risk your life in this. Don't worry about me. Now go back to your sister's side. Just a minute. I swear, have you taken leave of your... <laughs> Seth, where are you? <laughs> Nina. I'm here, Nina. Uh, Will you hold my hand? Huh. See, Zef? She needs you. Uh, Thanks, Alf. Come back safe, you hear? Roger, roger. And so I have a date with this viper, you see? We just met, and still you want to come and help me out? Shucks, friend. I owe you one. They're good folks in this village, down to the last, and Zeph's always stuck by my side. So, darned if I won't stick by his. So let's go. We're heading for the Cave of Ryo, just east of the village. We'd better hurry, for Nina's sake. All right, then. Alfin, join the party. Okay, inventory-wise, do I have an axe for you? I feel like I might. Do you even use an axe? You do! Okay. 
optimize. Well, we got a buckler out of it. And a hand axe is still all we've got on you. Hmm. Hmm. Felt like we had another accessory, though. Right? No, everybody's equipped one? Okay. Okay, then... Maybe we do buy a new axe. Yes? Yes. Let's do it. Buy an iron axe. 24 attack, more accuracy. Physical and elemental attack. Physical attack and critical. For a cleaver. Hmm. I don't know if we're going to keep Alfin in the party since he and Cyrus do like the same thing with their action. Hmm. Also, what are his skills? Alfin. First aid, so we finally have a healer. Okay. Ice damage as well. Amputation. Hmm. And poison. Vivify. Last stand. Is pretty cool. Okay. So he's a healer slash damage dealer. Hmm. We'll have to think about it. But I I do like it. Hmm. Can I do anything else with you? Nope, inquire scrutinize are both done. Let's go grab this. Silver axe here we go. This is why we wear it. Ah, glorious. Silver axe. There we go. Pretty good. I don't think we need to get the super expensive axe at the moment. But it might be worth it. Hmm. What item do we get from here? Essence of Plum. Okay, that's what we got for like the 12% from the woman, I think. So, okay. Should be good. Uh, we don't have a thief yet. I'm imagining that's what the thief is for. Can I do... I can challenge you. Sure. You wish to train? Such enthusiasm. I shall do my best to match you. Let us fight with honor. I am curious. Now then. Okay. Have at you. How difficult is a two strength now for a brick? My way is unbent out of my way. Not very. Each battle, I grow stronger. All right. So it doesn't scale with old brick, as far as I can tell. So it's not like a one strength will always be as difficult as it was at the beginning. I guess is what I'm trying to say. A fine fight. Uh, yeah, enjoy your nap. Glad I can help with that. Okay. Yoink. Away we go to danger. Don't be a stranger. Hmm. Nothing over there? They tricked me. Uh, hmm. What about over here, though? I see you, treasure. I see you. But I can't get to you at the moment. Hmm. We'll go around town. Want a tango, huh? This is very true, Alfin. All right, to keep Alfin no, alive, we are going to incite. Come, if you dare. It should keep him alive, in theory. Ah. Yep. Okay. I'm ready. Good job, Oberg. You, you, you. Tans person. Okay. You what see. is the logical course of action? Uh, just ice wind. There we go. All right. All right. Less all right. Concoct. Mix ingredients to create a host of medicinal. So this is what we can do. Hmm. I'm gonna wait on that. Interesting idea. So we can icicle attack. Let's cool see. off. Not as good as Cyrus's damage, really. Which makes sense. We did give him items. I'm ready. More attack power and stuff. Moonlight Wolf. The Moonlight Wolf. There we go. No more snail. Hmm. Oh, ice. Here's some proof. Oh, I should have just boosted. Oh, well. No. Hmm. Good level slash, but we don't need to. Yeah, my whole arm should still do Bring more damage on. with 
the moment. That's decent damage, Mal. Victory shall be mine. It's more than our dancer does. Hmm. I'm ready. Okay. That works. An interesting dilemma. Smack him with a stick. Bring it on. The stickiest of attacks. Bring it on. Alvin does seem pretty ha, fast. Try again. Well, that's nice. There we go. Levels. And a lot of job points. Excellent. Okay. We've reached 300. And we have enough on Elfing. Let's see. 300 is not enough on anybody but Primrose right now. Hmm. So we can augment elemental attacks, get dark damage on everything. Nobody else has dark yet. Speed thing seems cool. I'm gonna get deal damage to Dark to all. Just because she kinda lacks any physical damage. Maybe her elemental damage will be enough. Okay, the show goes on. And then you. Cure a single ally of all status ailments and render them immune to further ailments? Yes. Yes. For a turn. Or two. Hmm. And then we can try to get better axe attacks or poisons. Probably I will want... We have items still for reviving people and they're still good enough. So I don't think I need Vivify yet. It'll probably be better later on, right? If it scales with health and stuff. Hmm. Okay, well, support skill show must go on. Status augmentations you granted eyes will persist for... Okay, yes. All right, we have probably our best support right here. Hmm. So yeah, at the moment this seems like a pretty good team. We will see. Uh, and then right, I was did I? I did not get that treasure chest yet. That's what I get for thinking too much. Okay, we go down here, get this treasure. Thank you, healing great. Totally worth fifty money. Yep. Probably not. Let's see what you got. Okay. Well, everybody's gained some XP. I am ready. Hmm. Summon townsperson. All right. She's got axe attacks, so that's useful already. Victory hmm. shall be mine. Or your skill level slash. Ha! There. We go. Okay. We can ice wind as well. Oh, ice. Very good. Here we go. Hmm. I think what I will do. I can take out the river Froggert probably. Or the river wasp. Uh Froggert was here first. We know it's weak to darkness. Hmm. Yeah. We'll do that. Now. What next? Hmm. I could ice. Yeah. Oh, no ice! That's why we have Cyrus, really. I am ready. You could moonlight walls. The moonlight walls. There we go. No. The show is over. More levels. There it is. It's one reason why I was using SP a little more liberally there. No reason not to. So I think we go not there, apparently. No, no. Okay, we follow the path of Kabul. Find our way to another treasure. Soothing dust for our apothecary. And we have a save point. So I think we will call it here, dear viewer. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying Octopath Trans. And I hope you, dear viewer, have a great day.